tell me what's happening. Hi, sir. Um, okay, uh, Sindhu here, sir. Hmm. And then, so, Kesh went to this thing called Vipassana. Why is she going it's to... It's actually just a... What, what, yeah, they just closed the eyes and so many souls will be around there. Yeah, sir, she didn't know, sir. What do you mean she don't? We, because uh, before... We are, you know very, very, very carefully, we are all against meditation and going to such places. Why she go there? Sorry, sir. Because before this, she went there twice. And then after that, they, they asked to come back or whatever. And then she was like, okay. So last time she's already been and she felt peaceful. So she thought, why not? Then only after that, uh, when she was there, when she got disturbance, only I was telling, I, like, when I went to pick her up, then only I was saying, oh my God, like it's probably white cord or whatever. Yeah. I so sorry, I didn't think about it uh, at all. I, I, it just slipped my mind completely. Where's the girl now? Yes, sir. Yes, yeah. sir. What do you go there and do? So sorry, sir. What, what do you go there and do? Tell me. Sorry? What do you go there and do? Go there, they ask to meditate, sir. Just close eyes, right? Close eyes, meditate, and then uh, they will ask you to concentrate on if there's pain anywhere or anything, concentrate on the pain, and then like uh, the breathe and... and uh, uh, feel the pain coming and going and coming and going and stuff like that. Then I think, I don't know, lah, maybe there's something that's there that feeds off of the pain and stuff like that. Because they will ask you to meditate, don't move for one hour. Hmm. Something they do done. very weird things, sir. And, and then you cannot like touch other people's cushion and then like you cannot remove the cushion from the meditation hall and then it's like compulsory three hours a day you must meditate in a meditation hall. It's like very weird, weird rules that before this, uh, I didn't I didn't think about it. But luckily, I brought my book and my wand and then the whole time there, I was doing aura cleansing, I was doing divine fire, I was doing uh, uh, divine fire, my I soul, am. I am, I am light. Then one of the days, I decided like maybe I, like I forgot to, I forgot to like, ask you whether it's okay to go and everything. Suddenly, I was thinking. Lah. So I did the blessing place of worship. Mm. Then at night, suddenly, I had this dream that uh, there, was this, there was this thing from far, far looking at me, like wanting to come closer but cannot come closer with orange eyes, sir. Mm. Then like the next day, I, I already feel like very suspect and everything. And they don't let you leave like un until you finish the 10 days. They mm. make you stay. And then, like, they take away your phone and everything. Lah. So I couldn't even call Sindhu to ask anything or anything. Then I, I since I brought my wand and everything, so I I tried to sense and see whether uh, this place is dangerous or not. Mm. Then when when I when I sensed the place dangerous or not, the wand moved. So it's yes. Lah. Mm. But then after that, it after that, I tried sensing anything. The wand was just stuck. It didn't want to go left and right. Then I dropped the one, it dropped lah, sendiri. Mm. Like it didn't like stuck anywhere or what. But it, it, I couldn't do left and right. So the thing is, when after sending pace dangerous or not, when she wanted to go back to the energy body, the one was stuck mid-air. Mm. She couldn't put it back to the energy body. Yeah. yeah because lots and then of, after that, when... Lots of souls will come huh? and disturb you. Why, why are you doing here? What are you bringing here? Oh. Then... Then after that, when I dropped the wand and everything, then I, I pick it up again to try and sense other things and everything. The wand refused to move as if something holding it in place. Yeah. I even like uh, ask like normal questions and everything. Also, like the things that I will, I know for sure the wand should move. Yes, and everything. The wand refused to move at all. Then I got scared. Then I did uh, aura cleansing. I did like I continued doing aura cleansing, divine fire, and all that. I didn't want to anger the thing by first. First, I was thinking just finish the ten days because uh, I don't want to anger it and suddenly go off fast and everything. Then you'll get angry and and do something like mm. kind of attachment or what. Mm. And then after that, like I really couldn't take it and everything. After I had three dreams where first was my my brother saying I, we have to go we have to go uh, my dog kinda kidnap we have to go then after that Sindhu twice came in uh, my dream about two separate things saying we need to go we need to go now we need to go now we need to go now mm. so then only I was thinking like no that's that's really like absolutely I must go because like like very very dangerous to be here even the one was saying that it was dangerous what mm. then. Um, then, sir, when she tried escaping after that, mm. they didn't want to let her go, sir. Yeah. 
first they were saying, oh, uh, Sindhu will be asleep at 9.30. How how can you call her at so, such late hour and everything? You're disturbing at such late hour. And then I was like, no, Sindhu always sleep very late. Mm. And like, she, they really, really didn't, until they were saying, oh, you probably got the number wrong. Mm. It, there's very bad reception here. They, then they're telling me, first Sindhu wanted to pick me up that night itself. Mm. Then they were insisting and saying, no, no, no. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, she can only pick up tomorrow morning because it's too late, it's too dangerous to drive at night and we locked the gates already, the servers all went to sleep already. She cannot and leave. Basically, she cannot leave. leave. Basically, like, there's, the kunchi is with the server and the server is not going, we don't want to wake up the servers to leave and everything. But I was thinking at least they're saying uh, leave tomorrow and everything. What's come to us, what I did was, I, I said, I tried to make sure I didn't sleep, didn't sleep, didn't sleep, doing divine fire, doing... Uh, affirmations, I am, I am like um, aura cleansing, mm. but then I tertido one and a half hours, like I trying to awake, sitting down I tertido, mm. then when I woke up that time, I look in the mirror suddenly, like I didn't try to, to move my face or anything suddenly my eye twitch into a wink, and some very creepy smile, I've never smiled like that before uncle, uh, sir mm. She saw her own reflection smiling back at us. Yeah, and I didn't wink, sir. So now you know what kind of place that is, right? Yeah, sir, that's crazy. Actually, what is going on there, sir? What's happening? All occult practice, lah. They will say, lah, Buddha, this, lah, nonsense, all. It's all occult practice. Yeah. Mm. They bring you into one, one, one line of, of thoughts, and you must be here, you must be there, and then slowly they catch you, like. Otherwise, why are they asking you to come back? You don't have to go back, right? It's good. Yeah, exactly. Even even the first time that I went, right, mm. uh, I felt very peaceful and everything. Then, like, I immediately came back. I got a job and everything. Mm. But then, I I realized that when I came back, about some few months after that, I got my my uterus issue that I had to go for chemotherapy. Mm. Then suddenly, this time only, I suddenly realized, hey, maybe it's connected to it. Mm. I, but I don't know lah. Sir, mm. coming after I went and kidnapped her and brought her back, sir. I don't know whether dark energy or what. First, gonna summon, sir. <laughs> yeah. First, Sindhu, Sindhu. Yeah, because I was driving and then after that, uh, for the first time, I got summoned by police. Why? I was so confused. I was like, because he said I was driving fast. Then I said, oh, okay. But then I was not doing uh, 135. So then after that, I said, okay, okay. I just took the summon and I should have. I said, never mind. If this is the how we escape this fine, this jalan only, <laughs> at least not accident or what. You got hundred, and then when went, 200, 300, 300, 400. You, know? you got four hundred souls with you right now. Four hundred okay. souls with me or her, sir, or both of us. Both of you. Nice. Uh -huh. Nice, huh? What? <laughs> nice, sir. Nice. I swear, I, I've been anxious the whole day today. I don't know what to do. So remember the other day I messaged you. Mm. Suddenly, I got that anxiety attack, right? And then you said there's a female soul from a temple. Mm. And then I told you I never go to any temple. Is it from this organization, uh, sir? Because I no, went that, and that dropped was, her. That, that was a temple. Yes, sir. Mm. Oh, okay. Now it makes sense, sir, because I went and dropped her. Mm. And that day that I was anxious, that side she was dreaming of me telling, and I was telling her, let's go, let's go now, let's go now. Oh. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. Just close your eyes, both of you. And okay. Just do, and just do divine fire for yourself right now. Okay, sir. Think of the Vipassana, please. Okay, sir. Okay, done. Mm -hmm. So you all, you all need to understand one important thing. When you go to a place, you close your eyes. You don't know what's happening to you. Anything can get inside. Anything can get inside you. Know? It may look nice. You can get all the uh, good things from the dark side. And you feel comfortable. Oh, see, I go there, everything's happening. You know? Yeah, it can happen that way also. At the same time, the loss of us will keep on coming back, coming back, coming back, coming back to the place. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So these are things you got to be very, okay. very, you got to be very, very careful. It's all just okay, practices so. connecting to the dark side. You can say whatever you want. Oh, no, it's Buddha. 
is this you said you can say whatever yeah. it's all connected no, to that, after sir. This, no such thing no such thing no <laughs> temples sir no meditation <laughs> nothing sir only pvh sir only divine imagine fire. sir i went and just dropped her at the car park and i drove i left ready you know sir and you can follow me some more of course and then after that i went pick me up she she hugged me and everything that's why like uh, we asked rajesh akka and she said uh, sindhu already got affected like yeah. my energy all is back no, and then akka said why why did touch her no because it'll be like it'd be like uh, you all also can join why are you going back you should come and join us like that lah so so i felt that actually you know when i went and dropped her i was thinking like oh uh, i should have joined her and everything and then any anyway, like there's another thought in my head of like why do i need to go Yeah. So then I just like ah shut up. I told myself to shut up lah, and then I went. I went already. <laughs> yeah, because you went all the way there. It was why can't you come and join us? You also can think. It's like it's like call, some 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 invisible thing calling you. No, come 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 come. Yeah, yeah. So now, sir, her wand is her wand okay? Because the fellow touched the wand or something. Who touched the wand? No, I mean like her wand got stuck mid air, right? No, so I don't know fine. whether it's fine. It's the fine. thing got. It's fine now. It's fine. Okay. It's fine. Don't worry. Okay, thank you so much, sir. So much, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Do you have read affirmation like page seven for anything? No, it's no more than that. Don't worry. Okay, thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay, sir. sir one one question before you go. Side track, side track, lah. Mm. Okay. Uh, Kishina is saying this guy Hans that she asked you about the other day, mm. but then she checking energy, sir, because he recently before this he said he didn't want a relationship. But then now he said he wants her to be his girlfriend and he cannot be without her. And she also hugged me, uh, sir. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know whether it's fine, it's <laughs> I don't know whether anything. Sorry. It's, it's fine. fine. No problem. It's fine. Okay. Nothing. 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 The energy of the relationship. Not so good, lah. Not so good, ah. Uh. Not so good means to divine fire or let go, sir. Is he a nice person? I am seeing zero energy. Uh oh. -uh. Okay, sir. Yes, so no need divine fire or anything. I cannot fix her. Huh? What for? You want to fix something? Then tomorrow the thing you have to keep on fixing, fixing, fixing. So sometimes you okay, keep sir, on thank fixing, you. fixing, okay. fixing. When is the end? Yeah, yeah. Mm. That's true. Mm. Be careful, lah. Uh, why? Why take uh, unnecessary time? Yeah. Mm. Thanks, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Sorry thank for disturbing, so sir. You know where I am now? Huh? Huh? You know where I am now? In Mexico. Oh, Mexico. Very good. Bye. <laughs> we keep updated, sir. Don't worry. Mm, <laughs> sir, bye, bye. on the dark moon day, are you are you having? Uh, I don't know where I will be. Like, I don't know where I will be. Hopefully, we can do it. Lah. I don't know where I will be. Be city. Okay. Be I don't know how because the time difference now. Now it's about I... six. It's, it's about six six thirty in the morning. You know. Oh my yeah. God. So then we have sorry, class. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. You, no, no, it's six thirty in the morning, but then it's, it's different for your time. So we see how, okay? Okay, okay sir. Thank you so much. Bye.